I'm Bronwyn Malden. I'm creator of Gorilla Reads, the online video literary magazine, and I'm also the author of Body of Work. It's a new Kindle single I have out. I'm going to read from the beginning of it, and in order to fully appreciate it, you might want to imagine that I am an elderly, white-haired gentleman, and perhaps that I'm smoking a pipe. At my age, a man comes to expect awards with titles referring to lifetime, or body of work, or contribution to the field. Academic societies present these to me in lieu of the awards I might have received as a younger man for specific discoveries. After passing me over for 50 years, the scientific community has finally begun to make amends. They tell me the totality of what I did in my career is greater than the sum of its parts. These are empty words. I prefer to think they have come to realize the error of their ways. If they haven't yet, I know they will tonight. First though, I have some empty words for them. Better late than never. At least they didn't try to satisfy themselves with something so tawdry as a gold watch. Before me now is the task of writing a speech to thank my benefactors for the award I shall receive at the gala ball, gala ball and fundraiser tonight. I should express myself as grateful, but not fawning. Appreciative without seeming to grovel. It should be leavened with the touch of arrogance that confirms they were right to give me this award. At the same time, it should reassure them if they had received this award, they would have shown more deference to their ostensible peers. After all, they give me this award primarily in order to confirm their own superiority. I know these men and women. They are scientists like me. Tonight, I shall disappoint and yet titillate my audience once again by repeating this hard and fast truth. I did not discover the planet Theravant. Despite everything, I have always maintained that position. Still, I understand why so many choose to bestow this honor upon me. It is because I mapped the strange planet and stood firm in the face of contradictory scientific evidence to insist it had once supported life.